Hi guys, Dr. Maria Krenak here, and I'm uh, going to adjust my hat because I love my Feeding Alaska hat, um, but I am coming to you from our building at the Lifeline Outreach Center right here in Chugiak, Alaska, and I just want to let you know that this is the time of year that we begin to do some fundraising to raise funds to purchase brand new winter coats for kids and for the homeless and for the villages. We absolutely love the villages. Um, we miss getting out there. We're looking for getting out there in 2022. Um, whereas we couldn't get out there this last year because of the whole, um, the, the C word. I don't want to say it, but anyways, we are fully expecting to get out to the villages in 2022, but we, this last year, we sent out coats to the villages and um, we sent out coats to uh, brand new coats for, for kids to gamble. Um, and Sabunga, that's on a, on St. Lawrence Island, 40 miles off the coast of Russia. And I know they were very grateful for them. We sent coats to Mountain Village. We sent coats to Kobuk. Um, oh, excuse me, not Kobuk, Kotlik. I get those two villages mixed up, but Kobuk you reached out to me and we, we will get you some coats. Hallelujah. But we got coats in Kotlik just arrived like a week ago this summer and they were thrilled to get coats in summer. Guys, you gotta, for those of you that don't know Alaska, a lot of the villages, you know, their, their, uh, high temperature is 40 degrees. So coats are pretty much a year round thing for Alaska. And then we sent coats to uh, Benatai, Gary Simple's village, hallelujah. Um, and then we sent coats to, um, there's another village in there, Kivalina. Yes. How could we forget Kivalina? We love you, Kivalina. But um, so we want to continue to send coats out to the villages um, and be a blessing to these guys. And a lot of these guys, I believe, are still in lockdown. Um, I'm not uh, I'm completely sure on that, if that is fully accurate, but that's my understanding. If, if that is not true, reach out and let me know. Um, but it's been difficult for them to, to get in and out of, of some of these villages. But we want to have coats for kids and coats for the homeless in Anchorage and be able to send these coats out to the villages this next year. It's such a blessing for the people. You know, when the Word of God talks about when Jesus says, if you've done... Uh, uh, if you've given one of these little ones a cup of water that you've done it unto me. And so when we do these things for, you know, it doesn't have to be always, you know, uh, somebody that just can't afford it. But when we do something for somebody, we do it unto the Lord. And so when, when a homeless person has Christ in them, then that means that Christ has a need, right? Because Christ lives in them, right? So when we do something like this for people. It's not just doing it for people, but it's doing it unto the Lord. And so I want to encourage you um, to jump on our Facebook fundraiser and, and um, go on ahead and, um, you know, click that donate button and donate whatever the Lord is impressing upon you. And so our coats that we get are high quality. We showed some of those videos to you guys last year. The price tags on our coats are between $150 and $200 coats, guys. And we get them for $20 a piece. So for every $20 that you donate, we're able to get one high quality coat. And um, of course, we're not going to just do coats. We're going to do thermal socks for the homeless and hand warmers and scarves and then these really cool hats, right? Um, so we do those as well. Uh, but... The main, the main bulk of everything is really towards the winter coats to keep somebody warm. We had a lady, um, uh, she was on the streets of Anchorage. This was last year and, and temperatures were dropping below zero that particular night. And we went out on the streets to deliver these coats. And, um, we had been out there all night giving away coats and warm food and, and, and the socks and the hand warmers and all that. And I thought we had given everything away that night. And this one lady came to us in tears and she said, do you guys have any, perchance, any coats left? And I said, ah, I don't know. Let me go check. But she had tears in her eyes and she said that uh, she couldn't get into the shelter that particular night and temperatures were diving really cold. And I, I honestly thought we'd given away all our coats, but I was believing God and I went into 
um, the truck to see if we had any coats left to dig back there. And we dig, dug back there and we found one coat left and it was a parka. It was a $200 parka, praise God. And we came back with that $200 parka for her and she just lit up like nobody's business because she knew that she knew that she would be okay that night with that parka. So you just don't know guys, that $20 may save somebody's life uh, this next year as we go into winter season, but we need to get on it now in the summertime because we've got to get the coats ordered now. It takes time for um, the coats to get here and to order the different sizes and get all that stuff done. So please don't wait till the last minute. Help us out to get these coats done now. And, um, you know, maybe God's really blessed some of you. Some of you, maybe you can only do $20, but maybe you can do $100 and sponsor five coats. Um, or maybe maybe you're in a place where you, where you can do a thousand dollars. Um, because for us to do 500, we're believing God for 500 coats. So if, if we do that, that's $10,000. All right. So at $20 a pop. So we're believing God for, for, um, $10,000 to purchase these high quality coats. Um, and then we're also going to do a very special winter coat distribution in October. That's when it's starting to get cold guys, right? Um, and we're going to do it right down in Anchorage at the Egan Center. So watch for that. Um, but uh, everybody was so blessed by the coats last year. We just really felt by the Holy Spirit that we need to continue with these winter coats. So I'm just reaching out to all our friends and partners. That's what's going on right now. Um, and we're uh, um, so we're, we're on full force to to uh, get these coats in. And we love each and every one of you. And those that have been supporting us monthly, yes, thank you. I want to say a big, big thank you to our friends and monthly partners that are supporting us. Um, we couldn't have done last year without you with these coats and, and everything that we did. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. And maybe the Lord, if you're not a monthly supporter, um, I just want to give you that opportunity, right? So maybe you want to you know, do a monthly gift at $20 a month right? Because $20 a month, that's 12 coats a year, right? So if you're not already a monthly supporter, pray about it. See what the Lord um, would have you do that. Um, but whatever you guys want to do, um, you can click on the Facebook fundraiser, or you can go directly to our website and give securely if, if that's yeah, the way you prefer to give. Or if you prefer to do snail mail and do a check or money order, we'll put that up on the screen for you as well. Um, love, 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 love you guys. We love Alaska. We love it that you guys support us. And we love the villages of Alaska. If you're watching from a village, we love you. and We miss you. Um, and we're looking to get coats for your village. Hallelujah. Be a, just to be a blessing. Hallelujah, God. God is good. Anyways, click on that fundraiser. Love you. Bye-bye.